and I have to think of an adjective that describes me that begins with the same sound as, as my name. So I do Generous Judy. I used to do Jolly Judy, but Generous works better, and you're going to see why. And if your name starts with a J, and lots of our names do start with a J, we got three J's, four J's in here. J is perfect because you are being, being what you want them to get. You're not even saying it. You know, somewhere in there, they, they're in the back of their mind. They're getting that this sound and this sound is the same, and the letter's different. So instead of teaching, you know, letters make different sounds and blah, 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 just be it. And then when you when you go to the teach the lesson, you, you can say, you know this already. You know this already. We already did this. Oh, here's a. This doesn't happen very very often. So if you can get if you can get a one in there where it's not good like that around the room and I say, my name's Generous Judy. And then the first student says, you're Generous Judy and I'm, and you're Mike. Magic Mike? Magic Mike. <laughs> Not Perfect. likely, eh? Okay, so this is the deal. You say, you're Generous Judy. You're Generous Judy and, and I'm, I'm Magic Mike. Perfect. And you go. You're Generous Judy, that's Magic Mike and I'm Talkative Teresa. Exactly. We don't have to finish. You can see how that's going to go. <laughs> and so for the babies, I, I put them up here so they, yeah. can, re they can read the names off. For the advanced students, I don't. They can remember that. And there's going to be a shy student. Or there's going to be a student with a name that's really difficult. And I'm going to tell you her story. Her, na her name's Melissa. She's from China. And we all knew her name was Melissa. In the class, there was 20 in the class, and she's sitting there quietly. So there, the dynamic is, the team dynamic starts to work on its own. So the other students are throwing out M words, and they're going, magnificent. She goes, no, that's not it. Marvelous, no, no, that's not it. <laughs> <laughs> and we could only spend so, so long there, and they said, because you're going to have to manage the class. So I said, we're going to continue to work on that. And we're, and, but we're going to keep going, and then at some point during the evening, when, when you get the adjective that describes you, that begins with the halfway through the class. We got through the whole exercise, la, 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 la. We're working on something. And she puts up her hand. I'm like, yes? She says, I'm meticulous. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever they say yeah. is true about them. They're telling you something about who they are, and the group also gets a chance to contribute. So you're seeing the dynamic of your class. You're seeing the ones with the great vocabulary, you're, and their vocabulary is sometimes incredible. You're seeing the ones who aren't shy and the ones who are helpful, and you're just giving them an opportunity to do that. So there's layers and layers and layers of great stuff going on with this icebreaking exercise. And then you save this list, okay? There's your hot tip of the day. Write all the students' names down with their adjectives, put it in your attendance or wherever you put it, and save this list. 